Right, hello, it's British Legion. This could be a long video. Um, it's all down to um, Justin Borges. Um, I think I've said that right. Um, I'll put a link to his channel below. He's starting up, he's going to do a video, he's done an introduction on his war, rule books of shame. So we've, we've all seen our stashes of mountains of lead of shelves of shame. Well, this is a new concept he's starting. So hopefully it will, it, a lot of you out there have got certain rule books that you haven't really done much with and you can sh tell us about it and what went wrong. So this could be a long video. I'll do as quick as I can. This one, um, I've got no miniatures for it anymore. I've sold them all. I did paint some up, never played the game. Massive rule book, really nice rule book. Um, but yeah, Warzone Resurrection, never really got into it, but that's one of my shame ones. Malifu, uh, I think season two, brilliant game. I had played it, Got lo did have loads of miniatures. I've only got one or two cr crews left because I sold them all to finance the Napoleonics. But it is a good game, and uh, I will play it again. That's why I kept two of the crews. Bushido, love it to bits. Got loads of miniatures for it, and I might even... I've, I've actually just pulled some miniatures out of the box to maybe paint this week, because um, I've been watching Seventh Son, and he's, he's flicked, flicked my uh, interest button again. Uh, and it's given to me by a good friend of mine in Australia, as we all know, Paul Beckers, and he signed it as well. Excellent book, excellent rules. And I love the dice mechanics in it. Empire of the Dead. Uh, got loads of crews for this game. I have played it a couple of times. I like the mechanics and I will go back to it. Uh, I promise. Uh, and uh, they're the beautiful figures by West Wind. Saga, Cross and Crescent. Did have an army for it, sold it. it was, I really love painting the army. Maybe I'll get back into it again, but I did sell it all to finance another project. But uh, And these are good rules. I like these. Through the Blood and Mud, never played it, just bought the book out of interest, I thought I was going to do World War One. Beckers, I was going to give you a salute, so I'll have to hang on to this till next year, hopefully I can give it to you then, or I'll post it to you actually, because <laughs> I don't think you'll come next year, or you might do, I don't know. See, I'm going through this quick. Warhammer, well we all know what happened here, um, I did have a vampire army for it uh, at one stage, never played the game, brilliant rules, um, loads of additions for it, but yeah. Guild Ball Season 2, got the game, I've got the ball version of it, which I will play, and I have played this, uh, love the game, very tactical, brilliant miniatures, um, yeah, cool. Infinity, again, I've got the miniatures, I haven't played the game, brilliant rules, I've read them, um, fantastic background and fluff, but yeah, so it's a keeper. Titanicus. Adapters Titanicus. I had a couple of the models. I've still got one model. Never played it. Beautiful models again. I just wish they went down the epic route, really, and uh, brought out infantry, like little mini space marines. It would have been brilliant. Oh, God. Smaller ones. Black Powder. Well, we all know what's happening here. Uh, I'm into the Pony Onyx at the moment, and I do will want to play a game of Black Powder at some, port, at some point. Uh, but yeah, love it. Relics, again, got the miniatures, still got them, and I've never played it really. I think I had a demo game with Steve. I like the mechanics of it, good with the dice, again, nice game. And it's this book's actually signed by the uh, the inventor of the game as well, which I'm quite chuffed about. Arcworld, um, again, very similar to um, the format of uh, Relics, but again, I had the miniatures. I, I, I did like the miniatures, and apparently the miniatures are coming out now are unbelievable. Um, but I gave all my miniatures away to Tristan, and uh, so yeah, I never played it. Uh, what's this? Zombies, Zombie Killer, uh, Jane Austen's Zombie Killer. It's a really little uh, fun game. Did buy some miniatures, still have the miniatures, but never really played it, never really got into it. This is looking quite damning for me, isn't it? <laughs> Test of Honor, got the game. This is more of a box game, and these are the little pamphlet of rules that come with it. Got the miniatures, really do want to play this game because I played, I have played this at uh, the Grey Zen Club. So, brilliant game. Want to play it. Gaslands. Good, great, great little game. You can play this with matchbox cars that you can pick up for, for peanuts. Uh, I have played about three or four games with my mate Adam in the shop. Do like this game. The 
Blood Eagle. Uh, got the miniatures again. Never played it. Um, really thought I'd get, was going to play it, but after you know, I don't know. But I will. I might get around to playing it one day. Probably not. <laughs> Who knows? Lion Rampant. Uh, a load of. I've had a lot of good stuff about these rules. Quick and easy. Um, I did have some medieval figures. Still have based on the Hundred Years War. Still got them, uh, but not done really much with it. Sort of a. Um, so sort of another underlying project, but I might get back into it. Dystopian Wars, love it to bits. Got loads of miniatures for it still, and I have played a couple of games, and I do love it. I love this game. It's quite an old one, uh, Tactica, Medieval Rules. This was supposed to back up my uh, sort of another it, sort of uh, looking into medieval uh, tactics and war gaming. So uh, this is quite a, quite a rare book, I think this one. Conflict 47, did have some miniatures, sold them all, and that's how it sort of stood. Didn't really do much with it. Team Yankee, love it. Um, Flames of War run off uh, into modern sort of Cold War. Got some tanks, got some infantry, and I do uh, want to have a couple of games of this at some point in my life. Oh, Flames of War, yes. Beautiful rule systems. I, I do like third edition. Uh, this is the singing and dancing collection of books together and I, I played one or two games but uh, not not in depth but uh, I will get around to playing some more and painting some more at some point El Dorado love this to bits um, got loads of miniatures for it painted them all played a couple of games and uh, I will play some more brilliant game but I don't think it's made anymore and lastly but not well 40k the old um, got one of the limited edition rule books uh i'm not sure which edition but never played it probably never will but brilliant miniatures and fantastic rules um well the way in this book is beautiful Whew, that's it um yeah i'd love to see what you lot have got out there and i know justin's got uh, a big uh tray of bits and bobs my god seven minutes i never made a video this long uh and i've got to upload it right see you later